Hello, in this tutorial I want to show you how to declare and define a member function or method. Member functions are pretty much uh, are like normal function except they are inside the class. Ok, let's see one member function with write out like that and we can define inside the class although we should define after the class but I will show you that now I just don't want to confuse you too much so simple write out the name a space and the ID like that okay now our function is ready to use it's a void which will write out something actually this is the name of it but never mind that no parameter and it just uh, write out the name and the ID although these are private the function of the class can uh, reach so can use the private and the protected variables as well and can call function which private or protected okay we delete this line we don't need it and just simple call the person one dot write out function like that so it will call the write out function for this uh, instance let's see right and run the program and as you can see it's constructed the constructor called and it's write out what we wanted all right usually it's a good idea to have the actual definition outside of the class and uh, the declaration inside the class so like that and this will be outside of the class ok the only difference is you have to get get, uh, get uh, this function or other functions from the class's namespace so we use the uh, namescape namespace resolution operator so the two column to get it from the identification class alright we can do a th the similar to the actual uh, constructor like that okay and uh, that's it now we can compile the program and we should see the so delete this semicolon and now we can compile the program and we should see the exact same result as you see here all right and actually that's it if you define outside of the class something you have to use the scope resolution operator so the compiler will know you don't want to write a write out function you want to define the write out function which is inside that class so the identification class and uh, yeah that's it for that tutorial thank you for watching and have a great day